I found uh, Ruby Gardens on the internet. Well, there was a chance to have a bit of a party, I suppose. You know, we've lived together for a while. God, we've lived in sin, haven't we? This place here has everything that we need. I was living in Denmark and I've been recently widowed. They've got me in charge of the tennis. And the house plans were absolutely terrific. On the tennis court, they call me the elder statesman. And occasionally I go up there, we have a hit of the table tennis and the pool table. You could find just the plan you wanted, you could have slight alterations, and I've got what I think is perfect. Swimming when I, uh, if I feel like it. Yeah, you know, partners passed away, and my husbands and wives passed away, and things happen, and life moves on, and we've now been married for two and a half, I suppose. Two and a half years, years yeah. yeah. Yeah, well, I'm a late starter, so... We won't go there. <laughs> <laughs> None of that. <laughs> See, I told you I'm a good girl. I could really go a long way with that. Who told you? <laughs> <laughs> One of the main reasons we came here was because of the houses. The houses are nice houses, lovely houses to live in. You don't feel like you're living in a shed or anything. It's a really a well-designed house. It's beautifully close to everywhere. I mean, we are one and a half kilometres from the Pacific Highway, 35 kilometres from Brisbane, that way, one kilometre from the station, and Surface Paradise is half an hour the other way. We've got a bus outside the door that's pick you up and take you to the Bean Lair up the Hyperdome or anywhere else you want you to go. You can go to the cities. Also, you can have an animal here. I love the climate. I love... I just love everything. I think that... Australia is the best place in the whole world. And why live anywhere else when you can live here? Yeah, you do form some lovely friendships. Camping and me don't mix. Yes, we do socialise quite a bit. I like to have five-star hotels. I love the fact that there's always a lot of choices. You can go out and do all sorts of things. I mean, I've talked about tennis, I've talked about going to the movies. It's, it's the social life a bit more than anything else, I think. I mean, there's plenty of facilities. There's anything you like to mention, including coffees and food and functions and all sorts. Yeah. <laughs> and it's as friendly as you want it to be. I'm not overly friendly. I might appear to be, but I do like to retreat. Uh, well, I was never good at bingo anyway. That's what I love about it. I can come out of my house down here, mix with all these people, have a chat go in for coffee with people. The food here is very good. It was excellent. And then when I want to go home, I go home, close my front door, and that's me and my dog. And it's lovely. Who knows, we're in a street called Kookaburra, which turns me off a bit. You get that. I've never been as happy in my life as I am here now. <laughs>